Rookie David Lingmurth made a splash this year with three top tens, including a playoff loss at the Humana Challenge and a tie for second at the Players' Championship. In just his second ever PGA Tour event, the 25-year-old birdied the 72nd hole to force a playoff with Charles Howell III and Brian Gay at PGA West. Gay earned the victory, but Lingmurth gained confidence. In May, at TPC Sawgrass, the rookie from Sweden was the leader after three rounds. On Sunday, Lingmurth missed a long birdie putt on 18 that would have forced a playoff with Tiger Woods. It was still the best performance ever by a rookie in the 40-year history of the players. Lingmurth finished the season ranked 75th in the FedEx Cup standings. Derek Ernst's rookie season was highlighted by his unlikely win at the Wells Fargo Championship. Just six days after receiving a call that he was in the tournament as the fourth alternate, the 22-year-old rookie found himself in a playoff against David Lynn. The 1,207th ranked player in the world won on the first hole of sudden death to claim his first career PGA Tour win. Derek Ernst arrives on the scene with a victory at the Wells Fargo Championship. Ernst was one of five rookies to make the FedEx Cup playoffs and finished the season ranked 95th in the final standings. 24-year-old Russell Henley made himself known early in the 2013 season at the Sony Open in Hawaii, becoming the first player in 12 years to win in his professional debut on the PGA Tour. What a finish for Henley! The 256 matches the second lowest total ever in a 72-hole PGA Tour event. Henley's three-shot victory tied the 72-hole scoring mark for the second lowest total in PGA Tour history. University of Georgia alum finished out the year with two more top tens, making it to the FedEx Cup playoffs, where he finished his season in 44th place in the FedEx Cup standings after the BMW Championship. For rookie Jordan Spieth, 2013 was nothing short of spectacular. Spieth started the year competing on the Web.com Tour with just one goal, to secure full-time PGA Tour playing privileges for 2014. In July, Spieth took advantage of a sponsor exemption at the John Deere Classic by birdieing the final three holes on Sunday, including a 44-foot hole out from the bunker at the 72nd hole. Goodness gracious! Jordan Spieth, how about that birdie wow. in the last? That birdie forced a five-hole playoff in which the 19-year-old rookie outlasted David Hearn and Zach Johnson, becoming the fourth youngest winner ever on the PGA Tour, a victory that earned him full status on tour. That is unbelievable. Wow. Spieth finished the year with eight top 10 finishes, including a playoff loss at the Wyndham Championship. This impressive play caught the eye of President's Cup captain Fred Couples, who selected Spieth with one of his Team USA captain's picks. Jordan finished tied for second at the Tour Championship, ending the season in seventh place in the FedEx Cup, the highest finish by a rookie.